Hi, okay, so now we're outside and we're gonna talk about curb appeal and a few things that your buyers are definitely gonna be looking for and things that you'll wanna do to make sure you get the most when you go to sell your house. So if you have a garage door and the garage door has an electric opener, please make sure it's working. So if it's not working, get it fixed before you list. So let's walk this way. We're gonna talk a little bit about curb appeal. You've got about three seconds when people drive up and they're looking for that sign that your house is for sale. They wanna see some green grass, and I know we are in a drought, so if you can, that's great, but if you can't water and you're really conserving, plant some succulents, go buy some plants and plant them. Just do something to make it nice and pretty and lived in. Let's walk this way. Take a look, this is a really good example. Sorry about the cars. Um, really good example of some a nice job of getting the house ready for sale. They've got their planters nice and groomed. Go this way. So if you have planters, make sure your bushes are all trimmed and um, green and watered. And if there's dying plants, remove the dying plants and replace them. Then we're gonna get, talk about the front door because the front door, believe it or not, and if you put yourself in the position when you bought your house, first thing you do is go to the handle and you're anticipating what's behind it. But if it's a really dirty, ugly door or there's cobwebs everywhere, you probably, if you think about it, you, you probably thought, hey, this is probably not the house for me. So let's make sure that the front door says very inviting things. And once we get to the front door, we usually have windows somewhere there. So another tip that's really not gonna put anything out of your pocket, maybe a little elbow grease, make sure you get the windows washed. So let's move on in.